morning. Today is my last day in Kishinev in uh, Moldova. Uh, with any luck, I'll be taking a train to Bucharest tonight, an overnight train. Leaves at 4 p.m. and gets into Bucharest at 6 a.m. I'm currently here at the uh, Valea Moni Law. Probably saying that wrong. Bit of a hidden gem, really. It's like quite a big uh, reservoir type thing. Out on the uh, outskirts of Kishinev. Protest going on over there. <laughs> English. I have a translator. Um, I need to go to Bucharest uh, today. Yeah, one ticket. Yeah. Cool. Can I pay you by card? Only cash. Okay. Um, is there an ATM? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Not 
too bad. I need a 10 left fee, which is like, what, 50p? Right. Thanks. Tomorrow, time morning. Okay. One ticket, the second wagon, yep. uh, sleeping. Okay, 86. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, bye. Bye. Just got the train ticket, which is in about an hour and a half. So, I'm gonna uh, try and kill some time. Cost 500 lei, and then you can only pay in cash, so it cost me 510 lei. So, still like under 30 euros, I think. I'll uh, add in the actual amount later. It's a train station there, and then uh, just in front of it, you have the memorial. Memorial to the victims of Stalin's repression. The, uh, it was actually made in uh, Belarus, and uh, now it's here in Chisinau. That's a train station there. My train's not for like an hour and a bit, but it's sort of like a 40-minute walk from the uh, city. So I'm not going back there and then back again. Just have to chill here basically. Eastern Europe or the Balkans, I live off these. Seven days croissant and coffee. Perfect combination. So this looks like my bed for the night. There we go. It said 86, which is this one. But with any luck, I'll have the whole thing to myself and be able to sleep here, but I'm not gonna uh, hold my breath on that. Yeah, they were saying, um, well, I was doing some research and when the train gets, Yeah. Yeah, it's you and you. 
Where are you from? England. You, no shit, I'm, I'll go to Union Leicester. Oh really? Yeah. Ruben. Hugo, nice to meet you. You too, man. <laughs> what brings you out here? Um, I'm trying to visit all the countries in Europe. Okay, nice. Um, and this is a country that's always interested me just because no one really comes here. Yeah, exactly. What about you? Uh, I'm going to, um, I'm going back down to Bulgaria, so I'm just kind of passing through. Oh, cool. Cool. Just uh, travelling or? Yeah, just travelling. Yeah, yeah. How about you? How long have you been? So, um, this is my third day, I think. <laughs> Do you have a registration for migration at all? Uh, in, in Chisnau? In yes. No, because I tried to go today but it was closed. Mm, yes, but you can to go to Chisnau Airport. And, uh, the airport? Yes. I didn't, I didn't know that. I, I thought it was just... Um, uh, maybe you can um, pay. Okay. Five minutes and pay. Okay. Okay.
he wasn't registered in uh, Moldova. And they think um, they're searching for all this stuff. And um, they take him off the train. And they think um, that his camera wipes might be something he's not allowed. So she says no video as well. So. But they're changing the wheels, which is quite cool. and told me I'm not allowed to go. They're searching the whole train from top to bottom. And uh, she came in and she was like, any drugs? So, I could be here for a while and I'm bursting for a piss. It's quite cool, they're changing the wheels over because the, um, the wheels are different um, from Moldova to Romania. Apparently, so the Germans wouldn't invade It's, it's like the most basic anti-malarial. Like every, I'm surprised they haven't come across it in the summer. You know, like people yeah, yeah. be carrying it around. Where do they take you then? To like the station? Yeah, so there's a thing over there, and they took me up to the second floor. It's an ATM just, sort of thing. Yeah, yeah. There's a little bank in the bottom. And Is it commission free? Or I paid in because I still have Romanian lay, so oh, and the exchange oh, okay. rates seem fine, so. Um, at, the, at the ticket yeah. yeah, it's okay, you can put it. Yeah, thanks. This is, this is why borders are, <laughs> you know, really, um, really, uh, really annoying. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Yeah, yeah, I mean, like, 15 euros is quite a lot of money for that. Curious? Yes. How many days do you intend to stay in Romania? Until Monday, so two days. Bye-bye. Right. It's alright. Thank you. I'll come back and I'll give you a passport after, after half an hour, Okay, maybe. thank you. really pleasant actually, really nice, really enjoyed the trip. Met a nice guy from uh, England, Ireland as well. <sighs> now I've got some coffee to wake me up and I'm just going to chill here for a bit, figure out what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. It's like 6am or 4am English time. Day pass on the metro, less than two euros.
perfect. Tell you that the yeah, yeah. accent of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Versus is different and the much like the my yeah, yeah, my yeah. beautiful instead of excuse my English. I'm, no, 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 it's fine. It's pretty well. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, fair but enough. But I, I like English from school. I, I, I yeah. learn. Yeah, you speak well. You speak now, well. Now, but yeah, when I was my one yeah. youngest, yeah, I speak better. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, and this is my, what I tell you because I, I understand you will not help me. Yeah. yeah. And I try to tell you how how, how, how much I, 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 I need. Yeah. In uh, approximately one euro. Yeah. I need now. And for you is nothing, I think. Well, in our country. In, in England, me, it's not much. But for me. I'm only 18, 18 years old. Oh. So even for me, I'm a student, so I don't have much money. But if I did have change, I would help you out. But you can have the rest of that if you like. No, oh, man, it's okay. Thank you, you sure? You will need okay. Rest. Sorry I can't help you out, but best of luck. I'm sorry, too. No, no, it's fine, honestly. Sorry, for my disturbance. No, it's fine. I, it's, it's nice to talk to locals. I, for me, it's much for yeah, yeah. much than that, than that euro this discussed with you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, even it, it's, it's very hard for me. Yeah. But it's it insane much for me. Yeah. I well. don't talk. I don't talk with nobody. You know, I don't talk with the dogs in there. <laughs> it's very hard. Yeah, yeah. Excuse me. I don't want to it's fine. make you sad or honestly. Enjoy honestly. Your, Thank your you. Bye. Journey. Here in Bucharest, uh, I'm just trying to find the hostel. It's. Half seven in the morning, so my plan is to drop off my bags and maybe uh, like edit a video so I can free up some space on my camera. Yeah, I was just talking to a beggar. He was like, do you have a euro? And I tried explaining that I only had big notes, but it, he was cool. He, I just gave him some chocolate and he was, it was just interesting to talk to. Wasn't any trouble at all. Wasn't aggressive, it was actually really nice. and spoke really good English. Um, yeah, just trying to find the hostel. It's actually warmer here than it was in Chisinau. Even though in Chisinau the sun was out, whereas here there's snow everywhere. I think uh, Chisinau was more of like a dry, bitter cold, which um, seems strange. But here it's sort of just cold. I'm not really sure how to explain it. The uh, the sleeper train was really nice. I had a great night's sleep. Uh, some issues at the border. Probably just a bit bored. Met a cool guy from England as well. With an Irish passport like me. So yeah, that was cool. Definitely recommend that. Probably prefer it to the bus. Just because uh, I, I find I need to be lying down to sleep well. But uh, yeah, probably had about five hours sleep. But then have a couple of coffees and you're good to go.